right, guys? We're going to be passing the guard today. Uh, this, this pass I learned from Zebeleza, or Leon Teixeira, who has probably the most successful kids program that I know of in Brazil. Um, this is the way he teaches his pass, his basic pass. Uh, here we go. First, I need to make sure I'm safe. I'm down here, boom, controlling the armpits. And I climb up, match the lapels, hold here, one, two. Control right here, arms locked out, controlling his hip with my left hand, right hand underneath his sternum, holding him back, okay? Very important to understand, I protect my arm bar, the arm that could get arm bar, with my left hand. So I protect this hand with this hand, holding his hips down and my elbow in. That way he can't get his arm between the arm bar. Not going to happen right here. So here I go. I'm going to step up and back from here, up and back. I'm going to hide my right elbow right here. Scoop, grab, bring my knee up. And I'm going to work from right here. A lot of the training we need to do needs to be from right here. Because if guys get comfortable being here and then passing, they're going to be comfortable getting to here. So we're going to start from here, a lot of our training. Here we go, I'm locked. Depends which way he pushes me here. My legs are behind me. I can drive to stack him up a little bit. I turn the corner with my shoulder. Now I have side control. If he starts blocking that direction, I drop my knee to the floor. As my right knee goes down, my left knee goes up. Boom. My right hand can scoop, switch my base. Now I have side control. Here's my position. Notice when I come this way, I drop my knee to the floor, lift my left leg up, and grab his head. Once I hold his head, my left hand can let go of this and hold here to be a little nicer on my partner. And I, I put my knee against his body bump, so that I can switch out. I'm still holding his leg. Now, before I let go of his leg, I'm going to drive his knee to the floor over there like this to turn him away from me. So his hips are, now I control. Okay? Another thing that happens from here, the guy, the guy switches up and he grabs my arm. He's going to pull it. If he gets the right grip, I'm not going to resist it. He pulls it in, now he triangles me. So i got to be careful about that. So, when he starts pulling, I have a couple options. Either I follow with my knee, so my knee goes through two, and I can think about passing, and I come out. Or, he grabs my arm. Let's get this way so you can see that. He grabs my arm. I take my hand, and I spin through, and I grab the center of his belt. From here, I can stack him up, drive, and I pass this way. But somehow, i got to protect that arm. So a lot of the training needs to be from this position. Step to the back right there. Hold this nice and tight. Cup. This can be thumb in or fingers in. What's important is my elbow is tight like this. So if I'm here, I have a tendency to be wide with my elbow. I want to be tight this way. So there I go. Hold, hold. And right here we battle. He does whatever he wants. Pop, and I'm looking to pass from there. Then once they're comfortable with that, we watch again. There's a lot of different ways you'll end up in that position. Okay? A lot of times the guy pulls the guard. When we start on our knees, face me over there, please. A lot of times the guy wants to, from here, he wants to pull the guard. But if my knee's up, it's very hard. I like to go and ball my foot my knee. So now when he pulls the guard, see where we end up? There we are with my knee up, right in the middle. Now I scoop back. There we go. Here's my position. Again, from here I can go over on the left. Up, or from here I can take my knee through and come over on the right. Should have said under on the left. Whoa. And there's going to be my pass. That's the technique for this week. Uh, like I said, I, I like to prefer to work back so they start out already open in that position, train it a little bit, recognize their options, then learn how to get there, then think about the ways that you might end up there when you're training normally. That's it, guys. Have fun on the mat. Reposition the guards, a good drill to work on as a skill for the week this week in the intermediate class. See you guys on the mat.